Parents are at that point looking for activities to keep kids entertained and mentally stimulated. Lions, tigers, and bears might do the trick. With us today, wildlife expert and CEO of the Columbus Zoo and Aquarium, Tom Stolf. Good morning, Tom. Good morning. I'm so glad that I'm with you today, and we're here at the Columbus Zoo and Aquarium, but you have a fantastic <laughs> zoo in Omaha. We think so. I just so. absolutely love it. Oh, I'm glad oh, to hear that. Oh, it is that. so amazing. Hey, describe yes. the exhibit and, and, that uh, you're in right now, Tom. Where are you? Yeah, so I'm at Heart of Africa, and I know you're building an African uh, Velt as well. Mm -hmm. um, this is such an amazing opportunity to inspire people. They, we realize that not everybody's going to go on an African safari, so we brought the safari right here. And it's amazing because you can see so many different animals from zebras, wildebeest, lions, giraffes, cheetahs. It's so fun to see all these animals, but it's also a great opportunity for the zoo or aquarium to tell a story about conservation. Mm -hmm. So when we're talking about what are you going to do with the kids in the summer, go to your local zoo mm -hmm. or aquarium. It's very important. What do you recommend as families are organizing a trip to the zoo this summer? And as you said, we have a nice one in Omaha, but is there a good way to organize a game plan before you even leave the house? Absolutely. Bring your smartphone with you because you're going to take tons of pictures. And, you know, you check out your website because you want to go there in the morning. You want to make sure that you're going when, well, it doesn't matter if you can't make it in the morning because I know your zoo is open even mm -hmm. into the evening. It's an opportunity to have not only a great time with your family, but also realize that that zoo, your zoo, is mm -hmm. making a difference for conservation. So it's all about having fun with your family and realizing that you're going to learn about these amazing animals, some of which are highly endangered and need our help. There is uh, something special happening with Frito-Lay that I know you'd like to share. What is it? Yeah, how about bringing your kids to the zoo for free? That's <laughs> very it. important. And the AZA zoos have partnered with Frito-Lay. So you can go buy a variety pack. I have one right in front of me. So go to your local grocery store. Make sure that there's a beautiful animal on that pack. And inside, you'll be able to get a beautiful ticket to go into uh, your local zoo for free for your children. It's a way that we partner with the AZA Zoos, the Association of Zoos and Aquariums, making a difference because we know that we need to make sure that we protect our planet, make sure that we protect our animals, and we have a great partnership with Frito-Lay. Mm -hmm. And it's very important that we spread that message and have a lot of fun. At some point when you were a young guy, I imagine, you went to a zoo and maybe that's what kicked it off for you, this fascination, your career. So what was the catalyst, Tom? You know, it's, uh, it's, I'm glad you asked that question because the best zoo that I went to when I was a child was definitely the Henry Dorley Zoo. No I way. can remember going in. Oh, absolutely. I can, I can remember going into so many efforts. I love the jungle. When you go into mm -hmm. the lead jungle, I felt like I was in a jungle. And then mm -hmm. I've been to a jungle. And you know what? It's the same experience. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. And it, it really is inspiring. And you know, that's why here at the Columbus Zoo, we have a simple message, a mission statement. It's lead and inspire by connecting people and wildlife. And that's what's so important for us. We realize that we have scientists and biologists, but they're only five years old. So we have to inspire mm. them and make mm -hmm. a difference. And so all of the zoos are working together through the AZA. We've developed a new program called SAFE, Saving Animals from Extinction. Today I brought an ambassador, and I know that you have uh, an opportunity to see oh beautiful animals um, at your zoo. Mm -hmm. We have a cheetah with us today, and unfortunately there's only 12,000 cheetahs in Africa left. They're highly Is endangered. They need our help. And so saving animals from extinction really focused on 10 species now, but every year we're going to add 10 more. So when you go to your zoo, the Henry Dorley Zoo, realize that part of your admission is going to help conservation. We combine support so many conservation efforts, and it's very, very important because we have to give back to these beautiful animals. Tom, do I hear that cheetah purring? Is that the sound? Yes, you do hear it purring. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. This is a this her name is Bibi. She's two years old. She's one of our ambassadors here. Yeah. And it's all about making sure people can, you know, learn more about this fastest land mammal in the world. Bibi can travel nearly 70 miles an hour. It's amazing wow. to see out in Africa or at your local zoo. Mm -hmm. uh, give us a website, Tom, and then we'll let you go. 
Absolutely. I want, I want you to go to FritoLayZooFun.com for, for more information. Mm -hmm. Make sure you buy that variety pack to get your kids in free. Easy enough. Thank you for joining us today and all the best there in Columbus.